So, the first step we're going to do in the uh, configuring context based access control is we're going to do step one block traffic from the outside. And we're going to be on router three. And on router 3, we're going to block all traffic originating from the outside network. We'll go to the command line. Cisco con, Cisco con PA5. Cisco PTY PA5. PTY. Okay, so over here we're going to create the extended access control list. IP access list extended out in. Next, we're going to deny all traffic from anywhere going to anywhere. So deny IP any any. Now that we have the access control list. Next, we're going to go to the serial interface, and that is this interface right here, serial 001. And we're going to block traffic as it's coming into that interface. Interface serial 0 slash 0 slash 1, and IP access group out dash in, and you're going to have caps. Um, for that name, exit, exit, copy. Let's take a look at step one. Results. We're done. See, I did that same thing. I did not, uh, when I first did it. Okay, then the next task, two, wants us to create an inspector role to inspect ICMP, Telnet, and HTTP traffic. So on the same router, three. Oh, what was that? Hello. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Okay, router three. And we are going to create the IP inspect name in out in ICMP. We'll repeat that same command for Telnet and HTTP. Yeah, I see now my completion is going way up. Now we're going to uh, create an audit trail, IP inspect audit trail. So go back into config T, type IP inspect audit trail, service timestamps debug, date time, and set. Next one, turn logging on to the host. 192.168.1.3. Looks like it's been initiated. And then we go into interface S0 slash 0 slash 1. And put that inspect rule. Spell it. Inspect in out in out. 
going on that interface. This is traffic as it's leaving the serial interface. And you know, that serial interface is this router here. As it's leaving, this inspection rule is going to be applied. Check our results so far. What was that last one? I think it's like. Looks like we're good so far. So the next thing I want to do is take a look at the, this firewall is working correctly. So I'm going to type the command show IP inspect sessions. And I don't have any because I have to initiate traffic. So I'm going to go on to PCC, go to desktop, and I'm going to ping 192.168.1.3. Yeah, that's the server. And now, after oh, I, 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 there's my audit trail, so I'm going to type the command again for IP inspect sessions. And this shows that there is a current session enabled ICMP SIS open. And now it shows this session has stopped. That's it.